As a stay-at-home mom, do you find yourself sometimes just lying in bed crying and missing me and just hoping that Papa was home with you because you miss me so much? Welcome back to JCTV, and this is Mama. And I got tagged by Sarah from Witch and Sarah Learning As We Grow to do the stay at home mom tag. All right, if you're new to the cha this channel, we have two boys with special needs, and we have Jonah, he's 16 years old, and Connor's 13 years old. Papa says if he wants to <laughs> follow our adventure, please subscribe. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna have Papa answer or ask me the questions as we go, just so I can, uh, yeah. Okay, first question: Do you have a daily routine or go with the flow? All right, we have a routine. It just works better that way. Um, I mean, well, both of our boys are special needs, but it just he needs uh, Jonah especially just needs to know what's happening next. What's what are we doing? Just all the time. So it's just better to have a routine, and we also homeschool, so just makes sense that we have a routine and just is easier that way for us. Question number two, how long do you plan to stay at home? I think they're asking if you're ever gonna leave the house. <laughs> just kidding. That's good though. <laughs> no, I like to stay in my house and never leave, I'm just kidding. Um, I plan on staying home as, probably as long as I need to. Again, our boys are special needs and it might be for a while, but I plan on being here for them as long as they need to. Number three, do you do all the housework or do you share with your husband? You better be careful how you answer this one. Just kidding. <laughs> I do all the housework, but I mean, I feel that that's my job as part of as being a stay-at-home mom. I feel that part of what I do. It has made it harder doing homeschool though. It's hard to stay on top of things, so if I need help or like if we're having company or a party or something, it, Papa will help out. <laughs> but that just it became the norm anyways because because you work full time and there was a time in our marriage that you were working more than full time and <laughs> so on your days off we wanted to enjoy your days off. I didn't want to spend it cleaning so. Number four, do you work on the side to make extra money? Just a YouTube, or just... That's the boys' money. Um, no. We're a one-income family, and we live within our means, and that works for us. And we like it that way. And, and we like it that way. <laughs> we like being poor. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> what you talking about, what? Because you don't work on the side, we get more time together, and that's, that's important. That's true. What do you love about being a stay-at-home mom? I just love being with my kids, with them all the time, and now that we're homeschool, seeing their progress, being with them when they were little was nice because I was able, when they were in school, I could make it to all their school events and stuff, even if Papa couldn't be there. So we just, it's nice to have one of us with them all the time. Number six, it says, what do you hate about being a stay-at-home mom? I don't hate anything about being a stay-at-home mom. Um, I mean, sometimes I would like more breaks, maybe. <laughs> but, <laughs> I mean, that kind of like... So more peaceful alone time? Yeah, maybe more peaceful. <laughs> <space. laughs> I just said that kind of like, I don't know if that, what's the word? Because I just said I love being with my kids all the time, <laughs> which I do, but sometimes, I mean... We all need a break. We just need a break, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Did you always want to be a stay-at-home mom? I don't think I ever really knew I wanted to because I went to college and I planned on graduating but that didn't happen. And <laughs> I don't know why, it had nothing to do with me. So I knew, I thought eventually I'd get half a career but, but then we got married, yeah, and we got pregnant and I wanted to do it but I think too we didn't really have any other options but then now that we did it all this time, I'm happy that we did. When do you shower? Mornings or at nights? Or whenever you have a chance? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I mean, the boys are older now. It probably was different when they were younger and it was more of like whenever I had a chance. But now that they're older and they do do, they can do things on their own. Um, in the morning, it just wakes me up and I just 
feel better. Do you put makeup on every day? Okay, so if you watched our channel long enough, you might have noticed I don't wear makeup. <laughs> never, and I love it. I never, yeah. Papa loves it because he doesn't have to worry about me like going out and spending money on that stuff. So, Just a um, simply beautiful woman that does not need makeup, and I love that about her. Sorry, I jumped in there. Yeah, thank you. Um, yeah, I never, I've only worn makeup maybe like a handful of times for like more important occasions, you know, and my mom always tried to get me to, I just, I couldn't, I don't like the way it feels and yeah, so now it's nice because I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> I think that's partly where some of the boys get their sensory issue stuff from mommy. She doesn't like things touching her face, touching her, stuff like that. So I think that's part of it. Next question, do you style your hair every day? Well, this, I guess, means style, blow dry, straightening. I don't do this every day. Um, usually when it's just me and the boys, I'll just air dry it and then put a ponytail or braids. So that could be a style, right? <laughs> Connor, how does Connor like your hair? Oh, Connor, he likes my hair in a ponytail. I think because I probably wear it in a ponytail a lot, so like that's what he's used to. But if he sees my hair down, he tries to put it back into it. <laughs> It's yeah, cute. and daddy likes it down long and straight. So like we're like, no, Connor, I'm like, put it long and straight. And he's like, no, put it in a ponytail. It's just, it's, it's cute. cute. Yeah. Do you work out? And if so, when? No. <laughs> <laughs> Life is better with nachos. No, if i not, but I've never been the type to work out. If I want to exercise, then we'll try to do like family walks or I'll do PE with the kids. Like I really like... We haven't done it in a while, uh, but uh, kids yoga. I do it with them and it's still good exercise. But Dude, it's hard. I try to do it with them too. I mean, I'm not limber. <laughs> well, because you're not uh, flexible yeah. or whatever. Limber. But it's still hard. I'm like sweating by the end of it. Yeah. What is your cleaning schedule? Well, lately, I haven't had one. It's just leave the house a mess. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> okay, but some things I do have a schedule for. Thursday, Friday, I try to do laundry, so those are laundry day. I like to clean up the di uh, the kitchen, like the dishes and the counters, like either after dinner or before bed. I don't like leaving all that stuff out. Every day the kitchen is clean. Yeah. Every day. Because we live with um, Ken's parents, and Grandpa will help out with dinners on Wednesdays, so I don't have to worry about making dinner on Wednesdays. Um, so that gives me a little extra time to throw in some cleaning. Sometimes I am a little tired and I won't do anything, but then if I do, then I'll do like vacuuming or cleaning the bathrooms. Then everything else is just as it goes or whatever. When it needs to be clean. When it needs to be clean, right. Next door. So the next question is, do you get alone time with your husband? That guy that's like the superstar <laughs> and who's so awesome. Not as much as I'd like. <laughs> We did go to the grocery store together. Does that count? Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, because we live with our in-laws, it is nice just to leave the boys for like an hour or so and we'll do grocery dates or we'll go pick up dinner for everybody, that kind of stuff. Do you get, quote, me time? And not me, like as in me, Papa, but you as in you, Mama. Um, see, I don't like going to the spa or like getting my nails done or my hair done, like that kind of stuff. So I guess me time for me would be getting out of the house and having like adult conversation. So like maybe like going out with um, my friend Laura, you know, just time together or even a date night. That I consider that me time. Anytime I can like get out of the house and recharge like away from the kids, then. Because you're spending a lot of time at home, not only being a stay at home mom, but you're also a homeschooler. So you're pretty much. 24 7 with the kids right thank you to sarah from rich and sarah learning as we go for tagging me that was fun <laughs> <laughs> you love being on camera don't you mommy yeah i'm not used to, to i'm not used to talking about myself but it's good <laughs> uh we'll leave a link below to their channel so check them out thanks for watching and as we always say let nothing hold you back we want to follow our. <laughs> you can do. They did a blooper reel in the last the one I was watching. Okay, Papa's gonna ask me some questions. I have no idea what he's gonna ask me. I'm scared. <laughs> when you're staying at home and I'm at work all day, do you just miss me so much that you just you just want to 
fly all the way to where I'm working and spend all your day with me because you miss me so much? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> good answer. But then I don't have anyone to take the kids. <laughs> good answer, good answer, good answer. <laughs> Do you find yourself sometimes just lying in bed crying and missing me and just hoping that Papa was home with you because you miss me so much? Of course, <laughs> all the time. <laughs> do you just lay in bed all day and do absolutely nothing like people think they do? Yep, and I eat bonbons too. <laughs> <laughs> As a stay-at-home mom, does your husband ever say, you have to cook this for me when I get home from work and it better be on the table right when I walk through the door? <laughs> Why are you laughing? You totally do it. I'm just I kidding. Don't know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What's up with that? What's up with that? I got lucky. This guy, well, you guys know, he eats pretty much anything. So. Did you just call me fat on camera? What's your name? Fat Amy. Where did you hear the word fat? <laughs> Earlier in our marriage, I would like burn things and like. It just stuff wasn't good. Like I didn't know how to season things and he would still eat it and he would say it was good. And That's I'm like, true. it's so not good. <laughs> <laughs> it's just because I loved you. I didn't want to make you feel bad. I know, but you never demanded every, anything before. <laughs> All right, so I guess I'm supposed to tag two people to do this stay at home mom tag. And I'm gonna tag uh, Jennifer from uh, the Ginger Fam. So if you have time, yeah, <laughs> if you have time and you want to do it, go for it. And then also uh, Brittany from Carter Corner. And I know it's not typically what you usually put on your channel. It's mostly about your boys, but if you want to try it, go ahead and do it. And if you don't, no worries. Yeah, buddy.